Jensen. I'm from Pompano Beach. I'm a realtor and I really enjoy this program. Some great uh, tips to take back and use in my business every day. within 
five feet of them and spoke to them, they would speak back. So conversation takes seven to eight minutes. So do the math in an hour, how many people can you have a conversation with? Seven or eight people. Seven, eight, or 56. So when you go to an event like this, who's going to be there that I need to meet? Make your goals in advance. Maybe you've heard about somebody. Then go to LinkedIn and Google and find out how to find out. And you speak to a group of two together, they are probably right in the middle of a conversation. And if you come in, if they're polite and they're going to welcome you in, their conversation is going to stop. The best groups to talk to are triads. It's easy for you to stand on the periphery of a group of three or more, look for an opening in a conversation, and then dance. The average person, the average person, knows 300 people. You probably know many more than 300, but on average, 300 people. So every time I shake hands, I am connecting to 300 more people, and that person who knows 300 people, those 300 know 300 more. So 300 times 300 is 9,000 opportunities. This for me is to so come. important. This rule of three is when you're meeting people and you have three seconds, 30 seconds. successful, you need to look around and um, talk to people. And I'm Debbie Pope. I'm also from Naples, Florida, Fifth Avenue, Coldwell Banker. And this was a great reminder as to how we need to make sure we stay open and communicating with one another and that people, communicating with people, are that's, that's, our, that's our best resource in how we can build our business.